Good morning, guys. Um, Chief, this message is for you. There'll be a, a message right after this for Officer Grow. And uh, first, I'm going to address the subscribers uh, because they come first. Uh, guys, good job. That, that's what you call the team effort. Um, they're upset about you know 5,000 of us getting on their ass. Well, the next time, uh, there's going to be 20,000. And we won't stop with one day. We'll spend a whole week doing this. Uh, now, Chief, take down my flag. Your department has forfeited the right to fly that flag. What happened outside your police department is egregious. And that you would tolerate that and think that's okay really speaks to the kind of leader you are not. The guys at the bottom only do what they know they can get away with. I am appalled at the fact that the gentleman in the plain clothes that was out there, not the sergeant in uniform, but the gentleman in plain clothes, is part of your command staff. This is unacceptable. We want you to release the names of the other three officers involved. Secondly, we want apologies from every officer involved. You have a video camera, get your PIO, she can record it, post it on your Facebook. Stop ignoring the problem. We've noticed that there's not been a press release, there's not been uh, uh, open comment about it from your department. Get up off your ass and acknowledge the issue. That's how you affect change. That's how you earn the community's trust. And right now, the trust in your community is very, very low, with good reason. Start being a leader. Stop tolerating this type of behavior. Officer Grow, I thought you had nothing to hide, yet your Facebook page has been locked down or deleted. Why is that? Too late. You're way too late. Next time, think about that. When you're dealing with the public, you're expected to be courteous and kind and professional at all times. If you can't do that, you need to find another job. As for your behavior towards that gentleman, my God, man, you're a veteran. You know better. You're out there acting, acting like a bully and a tyrant. You four bullies, y'all were really good when there were four of you against that one little old man on the sidewalk. How do you feel now? Cowering in the shadows, hiding in a corner. You have to have a patrol car parked outside your house for protection. Do you like that feeling? Doesn't feel too good, does it? That's what you put that old man through. Think about that. Learn from that. There are complaints coming. We're going to bring the regular media in on this. Don't try to do damage control. Just be honest. Stand up, be a man. As a, as a whole, in the department I'm speaking, acknowledge your errors, correct those errors, and move on. There are going to be complaints made through your uh, IED system and with your civil board. You know, you guys can cover this up or you can do the right thing. I'm telling you, we're not done. This time, I only brought 5,000 people to you. Next time, I'll bring 25,000 people. Instead of playing this role out for one day, we'll play it out a week. And we won't just go to City Hall and the police department with our protest. We'll go to businesses. We'll go to places you can't imagine. Subscribers. 
I, I've had some people ask me why I don't just go up there. Um, I'm not scared of these people. These bullies don't intimidate me. Uh, I'll happily go up there and get arrested. You guys want to donate $1,000 collectively, come up with $1,000 to my GoFundMe, and I will take four or five days and go to Peoria, Illinois, and video these people. So that's up to you guys. Uh, I'm game for it. I would love to go up there and face down with these bullies. Uh, that's it, guys. Uh, if you've uh, started the complaint process, please continue it. Um, and uh, please post this video on their Facebook so that they are aware of it. I'm going to email a, email a link to it to the chief. And uh, uh, let's see if we can just get the message across to them that uh, contrary to what they think, they're not above the law and they are not above being answerable to us. See you guys again soon.